Global equities were bought back in the previous week, helped along by more upbeat outlook on the global trade front. And this wasn't the only place markets were feeling better. The pound had a revival in the latter portion of the previous week, with the UK currency surging out from the depths of multi-year low territory on the back of renewed optimism around Brexit deal prospects. It's clear there is still a ways to go, but as we've highlighted in recent months, the most important takeaway here is the fact that there is a strong desire from all sides to avoid a disorderly Brexit. Exactly how this manifests is another question, but we believe the very removal of the disorderly Brexit component is what alone will have the pound in position to trade higher as that tail risk of disorderly Brexit is priced out. Looking ahead, aside from some China trade reads and Eurozone industrial production, the calendar is quite light. There is no first-tier data out of the U.S. and Canada on account of the Columbus Day and Thanksgiving Day holidays, respectively. That's all for now.